So where are we right now? The American people right now, I want you to do an exercise for our friends in the media. And they're actually nice when you meet them one-on-one, -on -one, but as an organism, it's, it's fairly evil. One-on-one, -on -one, they're lovely. Hug a reporter, tell them you love them, take them out for beverages, have carnitas with them, go out for Cuban steak. They're lovely as individuals, but as an organism, they're flat out evil. And the very fact that they go out and say that you're racist when they don't even ask you. I'm telling you this, when I get my network, and I'm gonna have one, my friends, when I get my network, It's just going to be one week of revenge. Just one week and we're going to get on and do real news. But we're going to have one week of revenge. And we're going to, you know what we're going to do? We're going to do what you did two months ago when the NAACP went on TV. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And, they, they, and Katie Curry is like, so let's talk about the Tea Party. You think the Tea Party is racist? That was Tuesday. What would you do, Katie, if you woke up and you saw on your competitor's channel saying, let's talk about whether or not Katie Kirk is racist? I think she'd be pissed off. So we're going to talk about whether Katie Kirk is racist. We're going to talk about where she vacations and whether or not there's a, a righteous amount of ethnic uh, diversity where she vacations. Does she vacation away from minorities? Are you a racist? Katie Kirk, that's what you have done for the last year, and we're sick and tired. Not only are we sick and tired of it,